What is up my stranger friends? I hope you guys are doing well. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. Welcome back to my channel if you're not new. If you're new, hi, my name's Allison. I'm gonna be doing a simple boohoo haul for you guys today. It will be try on, so you guys will see how it fits on myself. And I hope that helps you guys out. So I'm just going to jump on in. So all of these picks are from the new season category on boohoo.com. So if you are wondering where you can buy any of these, obviously all the links and stuff will be down in the description. So if you're curious, go ahead and look down there. But I'm just going to go ahead and get started. The first pick is this cute little cropped white simple long sleeve shirt and it does have like a tiny little collar or not collar it has like a mini turtleneck feel to it so it's not you know a big one but it's a low one and I feel like this just makes it more sophisticated and this is obviously a very simple piece it's white so I'm trying to stick to getting my staples and building around it so with this you could like put high-waisted pants a cute belt you could really go a lot of ways with this dress it up or down so that's why I got it just a staple next up is a piece I'm so excited about because I've been trying to get my hands on one of these for a long time but it was never in my size or color that I wanted so what I'm talking about is a blazer dress so again not really something I would normally pick but these are so in style right now and I think it's really sexy if you wear nothing underneath so it's like you know a bare chest moment obviously you have to like cover it with like tape or something I don't know how you would keep it closed well actually this one has a butt goal buckle <laughs> button <laughs> so it's not gonna pop open on you I'm not sure how I'm gonna style this yet I really just wanted to get it because I want to do like a really beautiful pastel lavender eye look with it I don't know I'm just I saw it in my head so I was like all right I'll get it even if I don't wear this out anywhere I mean I hope I do I hope I get the balls to be like you know what I'm gonna wear the freaking blazer dress and be that bitch so We'll see if it ever happens. The only downside to this piece is that it's a little bit big for me. I feel like with blazer dresses, you kind of need them to be fitted so you don't just look all kind of like manly and boxy and, and big. You want it to still show that you have a figure underneath. So that's why it's good to have them a little bit tapered. I got a size six because they were all out of my size, which is the absolute smallest size. So anything pretty much bigger than the smallest size is gonna be too big on me, unfortunately. I took a risk anyways, because I really wanted it. I'm gonna hope that it works. If not, it's just gonna show up in pictures and I'll never wear it out, which is sad. <laughs> Next up is a camel ribbed bodycon dress. It's long sleeves and it's pretty long. It's it's not too short and it has again that little mini turtleneck which is super in right now and sometimes I honestly like having necks that are higher like this because if my foundation doesn't match it like covers it a lot <laughs> and it's long sleeves so it's like your foundation literally can be whatever color you want it to be anyways so this is just going to be a nice little club dress going out to dinner dress birthday dinner whatever you know just throw these with some heels and you are good to go honey next item up is this shirt right here it's a cute little peasant crop top and it has the little fluffy sleeves that are in all lace. I just thought it was really cute. The model sold it to me, obviously. The models always sell me everything <laughs> and it never looks the same on me. But I just fell in love with this top just because, I don't know, I just really liked it. I mean, what are you supposed to say in fashion clothing hauls? Like, I got this because I thought it was cute. <laughs> It's just, I just thought it was cute, okay guys? <laughs> so next up, I'm literally just picking them at random, so they're in no particular order. I mean, what order would there be? <laughs> so this is the next piece. It's, um, interesting, <laughs> but you know what? I just, I love cows. This is a cow print bodycon dress. I typically love these kind of dresses anyways, just because they're long and they accentuate all your curves in the right places. Saw it on the model. It looked beautiful on her. And cows don't get no love in the animal print world. Like, why? There's so many animal prints out there and the cows have a beautiful print. I mean, look at that. So now I can represent the cows and look hot while doing it. <laughs> Hopefully. Next up, I really, really like this one. Don't know why, don't ask me, you're probably gonna hate it, but whatever, here we go. So this is the funkiest little sweatshirt. Saw it, fell in love, and I got the red color. They have a bunch of other colors because, I don't know, I'm not a big red person, but for some reason this face, like the pink and the white, it just stood out to me the most on the model when she had the red one on. So I was like, you know what, I'm getting the red one. It's out there, like me. Ew. I'm just thinking like this with some black running shorts, and white trainers, it's a look. The next piece is something that's a little bit more out of my comfort zone. It's a little more risque and sexy. It's this beautiful lace bodysuit. So as you can see, it just is full lace and it's mesh, so it's completely see-through. Obviously, you will have to wear something underneath this if you wanna wear it out or if you wanna wear it alone, then you can just 
go in your birthday suit. Like I said, this is not something I would normally pick up just because I don't really have the boobs to like fill this out. But you know what? I'm just gonna make it work with what I got and I think it will look really cute. I don't know what I'm gonna do to show you guys me trying this on because you will obviously see my whole body, <laughs> but we'll make it work. Next up are these classic camo trousers. Can you see them? <laughs> camo joke. Again, these are in a size extra small and I don't think they're gonna fit me that well. Maybe if they're meant to be super baggy, but I definitely bought them not wanting them to be super baggy because I like when pants make me look good. <laughs> a lot of the sizes seem to have not been small enough for me, even some of the extra small. So if you're super tiny, make sure that you're shopping in the Boohoo Petite section because some of these sizes run really big. Next up are another pair of pants and these ones actually fit amazing. These are the leather look front seam leggings. So they have that kind of leather feel to it, but they're obviously not leather. They're more like a pleather material, but super soft and stretchy. Yeah, just typical black leather looking leggings. Perfect for going out, pair them with heels, pair them with tennis shoes. These are just so universal that I needed them in my life. <laughs> Next up are another pair of pants and these actually do fit great so that's good. They're really stretchy material and they're funky fresh. These are a tiger patterned long wide leg pant. Super cute. I love these kind of stretchy material pants because they make your butt look good. I like the pattern. I don't know. I just really 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 love animal print like all different kinds and so we got the cow and now we got the tiger stripes and I'm ready for the zoo. <laughs> just kidding, boycott zoos. Next up are these classic joggers that just have a white stripe. It's actually kind of an off-white color now that I look at it. Yeah, it's like an off-white color. So bottom line, I got these to be comfortable and I think they're gonna do me good. They are on the bigger side. Again, I feel like most of the pants and also a lot of the jackets that I got were a little bit too big for me. So just keep that in mind when you're shopping. If you're gonna go buy jackets or pants, I would go to the petite section if you are my size or smaller. So speaking of jackets, this is one that just stole my heart and I'm so mad that it's a little bit too big. I'm still gonna try to wear it because it's an extra small so I can't get any smaller. It doesn't look like anything special, but it's very special. <laughs> so it has this corduroy brown collar, which I love. I think it's super vintage looking, I don't know. And then inside it has this nice little plaid material and it kind of like, I don't know, it just goes with the plaid on the outside, but it's like different. I get it, looking at it in the camera, it's not very exciting or cute, but in person it just looks very grungy and it's just a vibe that I'm really liking. So that's that and I love rolling up the sleeves. So it is supposed to be oversized, it is supposed to be baggier, but it's just still a little bit too baggy on me but I'm gonna make it work. Here's another jacket that I got. It is a teddy bear style utility jacket. So it does make it different that it has these giant utility pockets on the front. I don't know, I thought it just gave a little bit of a different vibe. It also comes with a little belt that you can tie around to make it tighter and more form fitting. And I know it's almost summer and everybody's probably like, why are you buying like big fluffy jackets? But if you guys are familiar with Atlanta weather, it'll be like freezing one day and then hot the next. So I actually still need jackets and you can never have too many because winter will always come next year and then you will have your jacket ready. So last but not least for the clothing is this cute little gray or stone whatever jumpsuit. So it's just a classic hoodie and classic jogger pants and they match and I've never had one of these before. I love them and I don't know why I haven't got one. So that's this. I love the color. I think this was some white trainers. Classic, comfy. You can dress this up or down. I've seen so many people dress up jumpsuits or tracksuits and I'm like, that's nice. <laughs> I liked it. Oh shoot, I almost forgot. That was not the last for the clothing. Actually, the last one is the top that I'm wearing here. So this is what it looks like. It's just a fuzzy material and it's got this asymmetrical one sleeve dealio going on and sometimes these can be super itchy and this one is not so that's good and it fits me good and it's a small and that is the last clothing item so on to the accessories and the shoes only one accessory and that are that are. <laughs> Those are these beautiful red and gold earrings with animal print. I think it's like a leopard print or something. I don't know, just super cute. So last but not least are shoes and these are the first pair that I got. So they're just a 
leather looking material and they just have this little stretchy thing right here so it's good so you can just kind of like stick your foot in and slip them on and you don't have to tie a bunch of things or unbuckle anything really really handy I have these in brown not this exact pair but shoes just like this they're my go-to because of this little stretchy part right here because they just make it so easy to slide into so I just wanted to get these in black they're a really cute staple shoe and that's about it, baby. Now the next shoe is pretty much the same, but it's blinged out. It's just got the buckles all the way around with the cute little studs. All the detailing just kicks it up a notch. I feel a little bit more edgy and like rocker when I wear these, or I've never worn them before, but I assume that I'll feel like that when I wear them. So I'm excited and yeah, I love these guys. Last but not least, thank you so much if you're still here, we made it to the end, is the White Dad Trainers. I've been waiting to get my hands on some of these, whatever the style was, I didn't even care where I got them. I just wanted some white dad trainers. I like how thick and chunky they are. They look like really nice quality. The only thing that threw me off a little bit was I thought the entire shoe was going to be white, but these little panels right here are like a different shade of white that it almost looks like a baby blue in comparison to this white, if you can see that. I don't know. I think the color contrast is really cool. I was just not expecting a little bit of blue in the shoe, you know? Maybe it's just me. Yeah, it looks a little blue. But anyways, I still love these a lot. So that is it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this little try on haul. All the links to each item will be down below, like always, as well as a discount code for you guys. So that is it for me. I love you guys, and I will see you in my next video. Mwah!